Thanks for stopping by Lifestyle with Melanie Graves, where I share stylish and creative ideas to help you do what makes you happy in your home. I know you're here for the fall home tour, but first, a quick update on where I've been. I know I've been MIA for a few weeks. We've had some major projects starting on the exterior of the home, so I've had to really focus on paying attention to what's going on out there. The first big project, YouTube fam, we are finally building our pool. I cannot tell you how excited I am about this project. I have lived in Florida my entire life and we've never had a pool in my own backyard. So we are really excited. I'm hoping that everything will be done by Thanksgiving, but I am learning very quickly that the pool construction process takes a lot of patience especially in Florida during the rainy season. Right now, we're about halfway through the process, so thank you for your patience uh, and my delayed content. I've really been focused on trying to coordinate uh, different projects we have going on outside right now. In addition to the pool construction, we also have done some work on the exterior of the actual home including stucco repair, a full house pressure wash, and repaint. We did stick with the same colors, but we just um, opted for a higher grade paint than the builder used originally because it faded so quickly. So that's all that's going on on the outside. That being said, I won't be doing that much for fall this year simply because we have all this going on. So let's have a look at how I styled the front door, the front door entry, and the family room for fall this year. This portion of the video is brought to you by Grandin Road. Those of you who have been with the channel for a while know that I have been a longtime customer and fan of Grandin Road. I love sharing their products with you. This year I'm sharing some pieces from their Hudson Valley collection. I'm pretty sure that this is a new addition to the fall collection this year. And I fell in love with this collection because not only does it complement the exterior color of our home, but the actual piece is just bursting with realistic natural elements and the warmest, most beautiful transitional colors of fall. Moving on to the inside of the home, I used the same Hudson Valley garland to style our front door entry table. I'm featuring this pumpkin, which is not new. It's also from Grandin Road. Uh, I moved it from the dining room because it really is just perfect right here. And it's always a conversation piece. Speaking of the dining room, if you missed my fall tablescape video, make sure you check it out after this video. I may do another fall tablescape since I've moved the pumpkin, but I'm not promising anything just yet. And then on the second entry table, I really styled it very lightly with this pedestal pine cone. It comes in a set of two. You'll also see them on the fireplace and then just a coordinating colored wreath. And the family room, keeping things very warm, cozy, and simple. All of my Magnolia fans will love this gorgeous Magnolia garland I use to adorn the mantle. And then to complete the look with just a couple more festive nods, I added the farmer's market pumpkins. They came in the perfect colors. There's green and blue and white. I'll make sure to link all of the Green and Road products in the description box below for you in case you'd like to pick some up yourself. On the sofa, I picked up just a couple new pillows. As you can see, this is Theo's favorite spot in the family room. He's always laying there. On all of these uh, throw pillow covers and then this pumpkin pillow that you've seen me feature before are from Pottery Barn. Nice colors to complement everything else I had going on in the space. And then the final look for the coffee table, if you've been paying close attention to this video, you will see that it changed a couple times, but this is what I ended up with. And those velvet pumpkins are from my besties boutique, the Ivory Palm. I'll put a link in the description for those as well. As always, I hope you got at least one new creative idea to style your space for fall 2022. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you next time here at Lifestyle with Melanie Graves. Until then, love and peace.